Hello, scrappers. Tonight, I'm gonna be scrapping this. This is a Garrity. It's one of those crank up, rechargeable crank up battery off flashlights there. It's got a dyno in it, so it's got a, probably gonna have batteries in it, two rechargeable batteries, and a dyno in it, so there's gotta be copper in there. Um, I already tried cranking this for like two minutes straight, and then trying to the switch the other way and cranking it for two minutes straight. This has got nothing. Um, it's been in that other garage forever. We're gonna scrap it. Besides, who wants to, you know, when you're trying to change your tire out in the rain, who wants to sit there and do this for a minute? Not me. I guess it's better than nothing. Ah. There we go. That screw don't come out. This one does. Oh, guess we take it apart this way. <laughs> well, there's the batteries. That's weird looking. NIMH button cells. That's what they look like. These are going to be going in my... That's what they were. Never seen that before. Rechargeable button cell batteries. These are going to go in my uh, battery bucket. I have a bucket in the other garage. I recycle batteries. I recommend you guys doing it too. Not seeing anything too yummy on here. There's a silver contact switch in here. Get these little tiny screws out. Or not. What could be holding this board on? Just those two screws? Oh, there's a third one. Let me try. No, I ain't even, ain't even gonna do it. I guess we'll just break the screws. Or break the board around the screw. Ah! Almost stabbed in myself. So there's gonna be a silver contact switch in here. I get this to pop open nicely. Maybe a little tap, maybe. <laughs> Lost it. Went flying. Well, here's the little silver. Not even. Was that brass? So we got some little bits of brass here. The scale turned off. Probably not going to be enough here to make the scale do anything, anyways. We got some some number two insulated. Some uh, low grade china board. Copper bearing. So they got, because there's the motor, so they got some kind of gearing in here. I'm going to hold the motor so I don't lose it. So I can get some of this plastic to break for me. Let me give it a squish. I wonder if there's metal gearing in there. You try getting these screws out. 
Oh, these ones came out. We have a metal clip here. Kind of heavy. Suspiciously heavy. Nope, just plastic. I thought maybe there'd be a piece of tin in there or something. There's some more screws I can get out. See if there's any metal gears in here. I'm guessing not. I'm gonna guessing they're all gonna be plastic. But these posts here, uh, I was kind of thinking those might be brass. But nope. And now, I'm going to call the rest of this copper bearing. Because there is a copper bearing motor there. So not too bad. Let's switch this to ounces. The number two insulated is not going to weigh anything, but let's see how much copper bearing we have. Two ounces of copper bearing. It wasn't a total loss. Instead of paying to throw that away, made a couple extra pennies on it. And we got some tin for the tin bucket. And a little tiny little bit of brass. Tiny little bit of brass. So not too bad. Um, just remember guys, scrap is everywhere. All you gotta do is find it, sort it, and hoard it. So uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.